Now this is a pretty big video. Obviously we have our DIY peelable paints and they are awesome for what they are. But you may also know that we have our Autoflex professional grade peelable paints and those are gonna look, feel and act just like regular OEM paint. And today I am really excited to announce that really anybody now can access and purchase Autoflex peelable paints. They were restricted for a long time for a lot of good reasons, but right now we have a massive team in place and a whole infrastructure that will take someone like an experienced DIY or a semi-pro who's ready to move up and experience Autoflex to that next level. And right over there isn't Gabe. That is Justin from our Autoflex team. Hello. Now, we have the Mustang here. And if you remember a couple months ago, we did the blue ember Ford color. Are we tried? We tried. We used it as an inspiration. We tried to recreate it. And we did, we did okay. I mean, it looked okay, but it was a little bit bright. It was a little bit off. This is the real deal. This is, and correct me if I'm wrong, real blue ember OEM paint from Ford. Yes. Which is going down on a Mustang. 100%, yeah. Exactly the right color code. Everything as if you were a body shop repairing or painting in blue ember metallic. So let's see what it looks like. Already I can tell you it's deeper and it's darker than what Gabe and I made. What we're gonna do is just kind of take a little peek here. I can see the metallic, but it is a little bit more mild than, than what Gabe and I made. It is gorgeous though. So the real deal, blue ember. Real deal, blue ember metallic. Yep. Going down on our Mustang in Autoflex should look just like an OEM version, you right? You wouldn't the difference. Let's go. I'm gonna bottle this up. No, I'm good for today. Thank you, brother. I brought something. Is it gone? So Justin and his team are going to lunch right now. Gabe and I are gonna be the ones that are just gonna do our usual mixing shots. And I think we may have to spice things up a little bit. We've got some Cosmic Crush color shift here. How much you wanna add? We're gonna, we're gonna spice this up a little bit, a little DYC style, <laughs> and then we're gonna see if they notice as they're spraying it. All right, here's 25 grams. I hope this doesn't screw anything up. I've never added pearl directly to OEM paint before, but I'm assuming that this is all compatible. People use our pearls in paint all the time. How many coats of this down do you think until he goes, hey, uh, what the heck is going on? Immediately. Well, the one thing we have to be careful of is that I don't want him contacting his supplier and being like, this is wrong, there's a problem. All right, let's, let's do a little stick of truth and see where we're at. Because this OEM paint is super strong, so it's gonna eat up, oh boy. It's gonna eat up a lot of that metallic. 75? We gotta do this quick, but I mean, they're gonna be on for what, an hour? We gotta get all of our regular mixing shots and everything, and by the time we get this loaded up, I don't think he's even gonna notice. That's 75 grams of Cosmic Crush into the Blue Ember. It oh, I is, see it. Yeah, me too. By the time it goes on, it's too late, right? All right. Dark Horse Metallic looks like a f tin of
All right, guys, we're all done with the project. And it turns out Ford Blue Ember Metallic is actually a pretty wild color. It's so wild that it's gone from one color in the tin to miraculously something else. And I have no idea how that happened. Now, Autoflex professional grade coatings, as I said in the beginning, are now open to the public. Now, that doesn't mean it's the right coating system for everybody. Obviously, there's a lot of you guys that are still gonna be better suited for the DIY coatings. But if you're curious to see if Autoflex is right for you, you can contact the team at Autoflex and you can ask them about what's required to get the job done properly. Either way, we're taking the car outside right now. It looks unbelievable. We had a ton of fun on today's video. I hope you had fun watching it. We'll see you on the next one.